Alright guys, I am back and I am going to do another video on my server. <laughs> But before I log in, you'll notice right here, Minecraft 1.8. And you're all going to say, well, your server is 1.7. Well, not no more. It is now full 1.8. Um, there is Spigot for 1.8, so I downloaded that. And, uh, yeah, so we're here, 1.8, and it's awesome. So there's some new stuff that I'm going to show you, including this. Let's start with this. This is the Fire Alarm Annunciator, the Fire Alarm Panel Annunciator. And I finally got it to work. Look at this. Silence. And it does have a little um, piezo thing back here. Um, and as you'll see, 1.8. And uh, my frame rate seems to be better with 1.8. Um, but that's because I have 2 gigabytes of RAM allocated to it instead of just 1. Anyway, drill. Boom. See how that works? And I have this indicator here, and uh, that only is lit when I press the drill button, or someone else presses the drill button. Uh, it doesn't act, it doesn't turn on when someone pulls a fire, like, when someone pulls one of these. And uh, due to the fact that my server has very little RAM allocated to it because of the 32-bit operating system, the strobes flash slow. So hopefully I'll be able to get a better host machine soon. Anyway, let's reset this, and you'll hear the piezo back here, you see? Alright, reset. Come on. There we go. Alright. So, that's not all that's new. Um... That is one of the biggest things, though. It's pretty cool. I find I have been trying to get that to work for a while, and I finally got it to work. I redid this room here a little bit. I replaced all the oak doors for with uh, dark oak doors. Uh, I think it looks a little nicer, but this one's still iron. And I put a sign that says "To Sam Nudge's House" over it. Welcome to the main lobby. Of course, that sign's still there, and the exit signs. Right, let me go back to it. These are here from New Age Server Alarm, so again, thank you for that. Um, anyway, look at this. Fire Alarm Control Panel. Do not enter authorized parties only. So, I've got jungle doors, I think. Yes, no, no, spruce door. Um, I've got spruce doors here. Boom. And, uh, yeah, so here's the panel. And you'll notice that it is no longer the MSAD33. It is now the MS8... Uh, 9857 DSA and DSA stands for detector sprinkler annunciator and yes there is detectors here and this is also new check this out device type activated pull station device type activated heat detector drill sprinklers flowing sprinklers idle sprinklers disabled that's not set up yet um, and strobe knack disabled which does work if I go over here and press the disable strobe knack that light will light up and the strobes will, will do nothing um, and of course this is the system normal light so if I silence it which I'm going to so I don't make the server crash um, I am going to go up here where the only heat detector so far is um, this is a design from Tyler Stefan 200 so thank you for letting me use this um, that little piece of red wool will basically disappear like like, come on, do it, do it, disappear, there we go, and sprinkler, so the theory for this is, once it gets over the lag from the server save, that's like the worst possible time for it to do that, come on, there we go, we'll put out the fire, and you hear the piezo going off inside the panel, um, going back over here, in here, you will see zone is active, system silenced, and fire alarm, and then you come over here, you see the zone that's active, zone 9, level 3, and then you see here, sprinklers flowing, activated device type heat detector, 
And if I go pull pull station, which I will just simulate by putting a redstone torch down here. Boom. And now that I've done that, actually that won't do it. I forgot. The the thing that makes that light turn on is actually in the detector or in the pull station. So yeah, and then it, when I reset it, the strobe knack turns back on, the sprinklers shut off, and it obviously shuts the fire alarm off, and eventually the system normal light will come back on. At least that's the theory. We... Okay, or maybe it won't. Oh, 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 crap, crap, it's gonna start lagging. I forgot to reset the heat detector, and I'll show you how I do that. Disable strobe now, quickly, come on. Please work. There we go. Okay, it didn't silence. Silence. Thank you. Anyway, I will show you how I reset the heat detector. And there, uh, there's sprinklers in here, and this is probably the best place for sprinklers because this is made of wood, obviously. I need to get sprinklers in the ceiling too, though, so it goes over the whole thing. Um, and there's none in here yet. Anyway, I'm going to go reset the heat detector. So here's what you have to do. Go up here, take wool. And then, preferably, I always use red wool, and I dropped a door. Where'd it go? There it is. Um, then you put the red wool there, and then you put a redstone torch on top of it, and then it's reset. The zone is no longer active. And I guess on my way back down, I'll pull this pull station, which wasn't here last time. Fire alarm pull station DSN services. Dude. Yep. So now there's no zone active. And apparently that didn't work. Um, whatever. And this is a reset button here in the floor. So now the theory is that the system normal light will come back on. There we go. See how that's on? Also new. Um, slash home panel. Oh, it's doing this again. Uh, eh. Why is it doing that? I hate that. See, it'll delete the whole word. Oh, it's doing that. Okay. And a. That's weird. Um. Slash home. E. E. Pan Pano monitoring. This is here. What? N E L. Monitoring. And look, I have so many homes. I've got stuff from the faction home, so let see, faction home, faction cave mine, S home, which means survival home, survival mine, survival coop, I'm not sure what that is. Faction flowers, faction huge mountain, faction screwed up torch. What the frick? <laughs> anyway, panel monitoring. This is new. Um, this is not functional yet. This is for the alert tech panel that New Age server alarm installed for me, so again, thank you for that. This is the one for the thing at Boss Domain. So if I teleport to the panel through that button, and I disable the strobe knack and silence the, silence the system to reduce lag, um, put it into drill mode, this light should turn on. Yep, and that light. And the sprinklers should start flowing. There we go, slash back. And since this is directly under the spawn house, it's lagging. There we go, right under the spawn house. See that? And that thing is still there from Christmas. Connor never finished it. Thanks, Connor. <laughs> Uh, anyway, back down here, you'll see that that's in fire alarm. And now if I go reset the system, and then come back, the signs weren't there for a minute. Did you see that? 
I have to wait for it to reset, actually. It's empty. Oh, shoot. There was still a little left in there. Not much, though. Ah. This is empty. This is empty. Empty. I'll explain what this is later. Uh, this is empty too. Okay. It still hasn't reset. There we go. And system normal. This is not functional yet. Um, well, you'll notice that it's now the MFP4, not the MFP3, and I'll show you that. Uh... Oh, and that thing over there that is still not done yet. Oh, this is also new. Since I have 1.8, I can use slime blocks now. So, of course, that's fun. You know what? For some reason with spigot, if I do this, uh, it's speed fly 10, it increases my, <laughs> it increases the speed of when I fly up, which is awesome. Now watch, I will fall from this height. Actually, watch the y-axis, it's just getting smaller and smaller and smaller, and boom! Boom. Boom. Okay. Actually, I need to put it back on 10 and fly over to my vacation home. Wait for the chunks to load. There we go. And here we are. At my vacation home. And with 1.8 now, I can have the correct protected by alert tech sign here. Uh, protected by alert tech fire and security systems. And here we are. Watch this. Ready for this? This is pretty cool. Automatic fire detection is now existent in my system. Silence that. As you can see, detectors, detectors, right there. I'm going to activate every single device on here. Why didn't that door close? Whatever. Boom. Oh, that has real arm. Forgot about that. Okay, boom. I forgot I had real arm. Re alarm, sorry. Not real arm. Real arm. <laughs> Fail. And that door isn't closing. What the heck? Um, silence. There you go. Every single device is activated, and I can disable zones here. Boom, boom. Alarm relay. There we go. And go reset. There you go. That's pretty much it, I guess. This wasn't a very long video. Um. Oh, fail. There we go. And tomorrow, guys, tomorrow. <laughs> I'm still a 12 year old, don't judge me. Actually, I'm 14, but I still think farts are funny, so don't judge. You know you like, you know you think farts are funny, people that are like me. I'm just gonna shut up now. <laughs> anyway, I guess that is just about it for the freaking video. Um, there's nothing really else to, there's really nothing else to show. I didn't do any. I didn't add anything else, except for the secret thing, which you will see later when it is finished. What is this? It's one of those. It's what you're gonna have to deal with the, with the face cam. Just kidding. Um, that is an icebreakers thing. I'm off topic. Um, I don't know what else I can show in this video. I. It's the window. I got most of the plugins updated to Craft Bucket, or to 1.8, and for some reason, I have no explanation why it did this. 
my um, simple prefix plugin was doing something stupid, I would set my prefix to this. Hold on. I would set it to that, and then it would stay. Stinking. Woke up the next morning, got on, and it was this. Yeah, it changed itself to that, so I changed it just to that without the little stinking these these things around my name. And also whenever I type, it's that color instead of white. I just got sick of white, so I changed it to that. And you know what? Before I end the video, I am going to jump off of the top of Bosch Chop into the trampoline. Boom! Like a boss. Slime blocks are awesome. And, oh shoot, I'm going to have to censor that again. Keep showing the project that is to not be spoken of by anyone yet. Um, this was the mines that were abandoned. Okay, now I can turn. Anyway. Whoa. Texture glitch. Did you see that? Hey, a bunny. Hello, bunny. Are you the poopsicle bunny? Oh, no. that's That was a prank on New Age Server Alarm Server. I basically spawned, like, a thousand bunnies and named them all poopsicle. It's kind of funny. Like, basically, I just... Oh, come on. Give me an egg. Give me a freaking egg. There we go. So, basically... I'll do it in this little thing right here. I basically went boom, 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 boom. Held right click until all the bunnies exploded how it like that. I just did this a whole bunch of times. I did it like nonstop for like 10 minutes. And holy crap, he was all like, what the frick? He came back on, and he was all like, what'd you do? And I was all like, it's the Poopsicle Bunny Massacre. Uh, kill all... There we go, all gone. And then I named them all Poopsicle. And if New Age Server Alarm allows me to do a video on his server, I will show you that there is still one Poopsicle thing left. It's a cat somewhere. Um, it's kind of funny. Anyway, I have nothing else to show in this video. This ended this ended in a pointless way. But look at the new place we see. You know what? Um, F13 I think is cinematic mode. No? What did I set for what did I set for cinematic mode? Oh, that was in a different profile. Hold on, I got to I got to add that again. Uh, cinematic Toggle cinematic camera F13. There. Oh, there we go. Up F1. Now get a nice look. Oh man, that's beautiful. Thank you, cinematic mode. Get a nice look at the main lobby. Isn't that beautiful, guys? Like, just that frame. I'm actually not sure what the frame rate is. But, it was, not F4, F3. It was around 50, 60 FPS. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for, thank you for watching. And, yeah. Bye.